His name is Xu Juyong, uh, and within China, he's a, a pretty well-known figure. He's a lawyer uh, and an academic at a Beijing university. He was tried in a one-day trial on Wednesday, uh, and his, his crime was uh, gathering crowds to dis disrupt public order. He was essentially the leader of a movement called the New Citizens Movement, which called for transparency within the Chinese political system. It called for an end to corruption uh, amongst political figures, both at the national level and at local level. Uh, but he was arrested in July last year because he had allegedly uh, was gathering people, uh, and effectively the movement that he founded got big enough to worry the Chinese government, the Chinese Communist government. So four years in jail for him. Uh, it'll be a blow, clearly, for him. He, he expected that he would be found guilty. His lawyer, who we've been speaking to, also said that they had no, there was no suggestion he would be found innocent of this. Uh, and clearly, uh, it's causing some concern. The American embassy in Beijing, uh, part of the Ameri American government, clearly has released a statement saying they're very concerned about it. And uh, as well, Hume, uh, Amnesty International says this is a shameful but sadly predictable verdict. The Chinese authorities have once again opted for the rule of fear over the rule of law.